Pablo Gunner here to talk nerdy to you about The Bad Batch Season 2, Episodes 15 and 16, which were the two-part series finale. It was sad. It was pretty epic. The build justified the means. What I mean by that is I didn't understand where they were going until they reached their destination. Why did they do this? Why did they do that? And then it all adds together at the end. But I do wonder, could there be a better way to get there than the way they got there? Because it had weight to it, but I feel like there could have been more. I mean, it was very unpredictable because of the fact that I didn't know it was going to go there. There were there was ideas, but there wasn't full explanations. How exactly did we get here? For example, one of the things is they go to this summit with a lot of the admirals. Grand Moff Tarkin's there, this scientist Hemlock that is this mysterious scientist evil villain that they've set up. They're there to just put a tracker on Hemlock ship and dip, but things don't go as planned as usual. Some other people there, some other rebels are there. That ruins their plan, that messes up their plan completely and it just it's just trashed and ruined after that. From, from there on, it, it's all downhill from there. And nothing goes their way at all. It's really interesting to me because they were kind of hinting things, though, about tech, where Star Wars Wanda Sykes, she's been kind of flirting with tech, calling him brown eyes, and, and trying to chat with him a little bit more. And especially right before this mission, she's like, hey, don't be doing anything crazy, so you better come back. The thing is, is he's not a very good conversator. In fact, he's really focused when there's a task at hand. That's something I feel like I can relate to in a sense, which is not really knowing how to talk to people well or perfectly, like exactly how I know they wanna be treated or how they wanna be talked to, especially because I go like, I know how I wanna be talked to. That's not how a lot of people wanna be talked to. So that's kind of how he is, but at the end of the day, like, he saves their butts hardcore and he makes the call that I don't even know if most of them would have been able to do. And it was it was it was really sad. It was really intense. The kiddo and I were watching it and we were really into it. And I kind of always had the idea that maybe Tech and Echo are too similar. They're interchangeable and you don't need them both on the team. So one of them should not be there, and that's kind of what happens, which is in the season, Echo did leave, and they didn't really need him that much. In this, they did need him, but it was also things that Tech probably could have figured out and worked out. All in all, like, things, crap hit the fan real quick. It was nuts. And it just went, like I said, it just kept worse, worse, and worse. They go back to this person. Let's just quit this. This is our last mission. That's it. We're done. Right, we, we need to just lay low and just keep to ourselves and just this this isn't worth it. It's not worth the risk anymore. They make that decision and then it just gets worse. If you want to set things up earlier in the season, like, oh, hey, they're working with this person, but they don't seem that trustworthy. And then they kind of get on their bad side. And then just how the thing, the way things are going with the Empire, it's not hard to connect those dots. Yeah, they set that up pretty well. It didn't seem like it at the time. It seemed like it was just random stuff. Now, I won't say that every single episode was really good at setting up for this finale. There was just like elements of each episode that led up to it. Those are the things you could have cut out and been like, boom, focus on that. I think that that's something that they could have done better. The way that it ends, I'm so down for a third season and I'm terrified and I, I need another season because I'm like, oh my God, I have to find out what happens with these people, with this crew, with the Bad Batch. I mean, it wasn't the, it wasn't the greatest, but it definitely wasn't bad. Tell me you thought.